Um, I saw that a lot of people question how you play so much poker when you're an investment baker. First of all, do you want to talk about, do you have, I, I don't know, do you have any interest in talking about your bankroll, um, how you built it, where it's at, what percentage you lost, anything like that? Bankroll stuff, not too interested about talking about, but like the investment banking stuff, we can. I'm happy to clear the air. What are your that. hours? Like midnight to 1 a.m. every day or what? No, no, zero hours a day now. So Okay, so here's what it was. So out of school, I um, got into investment banking. I worked at three firms. Mm -hmm. I was working last year when I moved back to LA for a new job. I was working, I mean, people probably like, they don't remember this, but like from March to November, basically March to like a little bit after Jack Four, I played once a week, maybe twice a week sometimes, but basically once a week and sometimes not even once a week. And it's because I was working. Like I had to work every single day. I was in the office for a lot of hours and like once a week I would slip out to go come play the stream because I love poker. Um, then the Jack Four thing happened. And you know, you may think like, well, how's that relevant to you? You weren't here, you weren't in the game. You were Javier's, man. Yeah. Well, Garrett like put my name in his manifesto and essentially said that I was like a part of the cheating ring. And that caused a lot of problems for me at work. Um, people in the poker community are like pretty like nasty and like people were reaching out to my office and like saying pretty hateful things and it caused a problem and I was basically in a position where I had to pick like do I like my job more or do I like playing poker and like having my freedom and whatever and so I decided to move on from the banking role and that's kind of when I started playing like twice a week here or a lot more commonly was after that and so you know that, that that's kind of like why I'm no longer working at investment banking but like for the longest time I was and like uh, I mean like uh, for uh, the whole time Ryan's known me like I, I've worked at it as a banker you know what I mean like it was only after the Jack 4 incident and like my name being brought up unfairly or whatever like that uh, I had to leave that position yeah okay so you were an investment banker you're, you're now you're a poker DJ yeah